I am being sued by the owner of the Burlington Air Park in what's being characterized as a slap suit. Um, I'm being sued because um, I advocated for um, a stop to a five-year uh, unregulated landfill on Air Park property. I tweeted a link to um, an editorial in the Hamilton Spectator. Um, and I wrote an editorial in response to an editorial from the air park owner. So it was well within sort of the public discussion. The coalition wrote a letter and um, uh, it was sent to the Hamilton Spectator and I signed it as a chair of the coalition. And I was singled out uh, for uh, this uh, libel suit that we're under. I would say it would be rare for a defamation case to get through trial without costing $100,000. I think it's a very significant penalty that uh, people are facing. And even if you know you don't go all the way to trial and you just you know it stops at a certain stage, it's money they're out of pocket that they're never really going to be able to recover. People's lives have been directly affected. People's lives have been ruined in some cases. Um, the cost of this thing is enormous um, and it has tied people up for years in a process that they should have never been subjected to. And I'm just one victim of it. There are lots of others. I don't think anyone expects that they will win in court, but even if we win, we lose because we've spent, you know, potentially at that point, hundreds of thousands of dollars defending ourselves um, against something that doesn't exist. The impact on me personally has, has been absolutely devastating. Certainly it's consumed all of my time, uh, has drained a lot of my resources, help us fundraise. <laughs> this is costing us a ton of money, none of which we have. Call Vanessa and Monty and give them 50 bucks.